What are we doing? We're showing off the farm. All right, guys, we are doing a update video. Uh, we are farming, talking about the hangar, why it's not done. <laughs> All the things. All the things. I figured it was just kind of needed to do it. So, um, yeah. Let's switch. All right, switch in. So, the hangar, a lot of you have commented like, why isn't the hangar done? What's going on? Are you still building it? It's not done. <laughs> Basically, the lean-to is what I have to do next. Um, and yeah, it's been like that since probably the last time you saw the video. Basically, winter hit, we went to Lithuania, we got married. Um, we had snow. We had six inches of snow like a week ago. And I've been doing the air bike and all that. So the hangar's going to get started soon. But uh, right now, it is on the back burner. And we are farming. I actually farmed like four or five years ago, but I kind of, I, I leased the farm ground out for the past few years, but I'm actually getting excited. We're spending more time at the house. So I figure let's uh, get the freaking cowboy hat on and start farming again. So I bought an old freaking swather. It's in there. I'll show you some videos of uh, Jason and I picking it up. It was kind of like, a really good deal if it ran, I mean old, like 1969, something like that. And then we got this baler. Don't mind all the junk. Um, <laughs> but this is, so yeah, we're doing everything. Cause usually I would do the watering and then I would just uh, hire out the other stuff, cutting and baling and whatnot. Now it's, it'll just be easier because usually you're kind of dealing with their schedule and it just makes it tough when you're trying, you want to cut and when you want to bale, you got to get the hay off the field. So yeah, we're, we're farmers now. We're going to show some stuff of uh, us getting the, the, oh shit. Oh, it's off. Oh, oh. the swather. Cause that thing is like kind of antique. So there's some crazy shots of us figuring out how to start it, get it going and whatnot. Are you going to show them how you built the dam things? Oh yeah, like lately I've been putting in culverts and mixing concrete up and just trying to get uh, everything to be a little more efficient for flood irrigation. That's We do part flood irrigating here and then also a sprinkler. So I've just been busting ass because the water's coming and uh, farm needs to be ready. So, oh yeah, the air bike. We'd like to say thank you to the sponsor of the video, Tommy John. When I'm hanging out and relaxing, I'm usually in loungewear top of my underwear. But Tommy John understands that some of you like loungewear bottoms also. But I'm not judging. Husband and wife Tom and Aaron created Tommy John 13 years ago. They are obsessed over every detail, every stitch, every glitch, every improvement, and every new possibility. How is Tommy John different? The fabric, proprietary materials perform like nothing you've ever worn. Fit, they adapt to the real moving human body so there's no bunching, rolling, or riding up. We all hit the ride up, if you know what I mean. Sylvia is obsessed with comfort. She also loves premium, high quality clothing so the fabric, fit, and feel ticks all the boxes. I myself love that they're designed for motion so I can unleash my body to its true potential. Do you struggle finding gifts for your loved ones during Mother's Day and want to give them the best in comfort? Well, problem solved. Try Tommy John today. Click my link in the description box and use my code Marcinko to get 20% off plus free shipping. Thank you, Tommy John, for sponsoring this video. I have not flown it yet. Um, hopefully, our weather has been terrible, so I really haven't had time to just with farming and everything, but I got new jets and I got a new prop which I'm excited to show you. Uh, and we're gonna, next video, next video, we're gonna fly that. So I think that's it. So I'll show you some of the farming I've been, I've been putting dikes in. Concrete, it's been, it's been a lot of fun. I don't know how well this equipment's gonna actually work for us, but I'll probably keep you guys updated if you want to see how the farming adventure goes with Big J and Marge. Mm-hmm. Oh, Sylvia's been uh, working. She's a waitress. All's been good. You want to say anything, babe? No. You want to say a little something? Hi. <laughs> we're having fun. We're doing good. We're just super busy right now, but uh, we're going to keep the videos going. They are a lot of work editing, 
It may not seem like it, but you would be surprised how many days it takes to put an edit out. So. Maybe Loki wants to say something. We want to say Loki. Say hi, Loki. Hey, Lokes. How to let's, do a let's show let's show the tricks that Loki can do. We don't have any treats, but we don't need treats. Loki, Loki's high five, high five, Loki. Oh my high gosh, five. you're failing, Loki. There you go, Goob. Did he do it? Loki, spin, 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 spin. 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 Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. <laughs> we taught our cat to do tricks. <laughs> All right, we'll see you guys on the next video. Bye. Uh, I think that's it. That's it, huh? Yeah. All right, bye. I'm looking at buying a swather. <laughs> like, what the hell are you doing a swather for? You can't put wings on a swather. Jason knows a little bit about farm equipment, so I asked him to come take a look for me, see if it's worth what the guy wants. It's a Ford. Dirty. <laughs> That's how you test it? It's got about 450 miles on her. <laughs> Built their new plugs, 1975. Oh my gosh, what am I getting myself up here? What do you think? Alignment's a little off, appears to the right a little. <laughs> Looks pretty dry. Yep. Because I can pull my truck here and just run jumper cables. Huh? Hydraulic stuff. Should we check the oil on that? It's got oil. Oh, nice. It does. Let's see if there's any coolant in it. Oh, yeah, there's there some is. in it. There's some in there. Might be all right. And how do we make sure that it's not going to start going? We just unplugged the jumper cables. <laughs> <laughs> What's this do? I don't know. The only way to find out is to start hitting stuff. If you just push that little chrome button, it'll tell us if we got enough power to turn it over. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, it did something, did it? It made some noise. <laughs> it made some noise. All right, ready? Sure. She's got something, huh? I just don't know if something's in gear right now. That's my concern. So, do that again. Nope. So, your clutch is, so this, wherever this goes. Let me see what this does. You know, it actually doesn't smell that bad. Oh, I bet it burns. That fuel actually smells like pretty good fuel, to be honest. Oh yeah, that actually looks- It's not bad. Not bad. Not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. Yeah. Oh, that's some old brittle ass line. Yeah. <sighs> we'll put this on there for cosmetics. All right, you ready? Yeah. Good, huh? All right, I'm stopping. I don't want to move. Should I put... <laughs> Are you really stuck in there? No. Oh. <laughs> You're creating a vacuum? No, I was plugging the hole with my tongue. Oh. I had it pressured up. Oh, okay. Oh shoot, I should have, sorry. <laughs> All right, here we go, ready? Come on, man, come on. Oh! Oh my God! Just run it, man! It's alive! It's alive! Let's engage this one. Work. Holy crap. It's yeah. actually working. There's that one. She's alive. So now you should be able to engage this part too. How do you engage that? Not quite sure. Oh, oh broke the chain. It's a wire. <laughs> we know the kill switch works. Yeah. I think it's worth it, huh? 
I think I just bought myself a swather. Isn't there an old town in Minnesota? Yeah, that's what I thought. My <laughs> that's actually where my grandfather's from. Oh. That's why I was actually kind of like, well, it's, oh, Atana, that's where my grandpa's from. I gotta get it. Sold. Sold. <laughs> All right, so this whole package deal comes with a baler too. Basically, it'll get me up and running. I have a small tractor that I think will pull this baler around. I don't know though. I'm good at the whole watering scheme of farming. I've learned a lot, baling and cutting and all that jazz, not so much. Here we go. So Alice Chambers, Chalmers. Alice Chambers. Alice Chambers. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Probably sell that right now for five bucks. Look at that. Yeah, it needs a little grease. Huh? Everybody needs a little grease after the winter. String should go right here. It comes with a free roll of string. Nice. Then you feed it through there and tie it here and there. Yeah, because this won't turn, it'll drag here, and then as soon as it gets here, it clicks it. Oh, okay. It's all in your you. timing of how many revolutions. And... Oh, okay. You do know how these work. Nope, never seen one before in my life. <laughs> Tag on it? Just Oatana Manufacturing Company, Oatana, Minnesota. No shit. Yeah. Oh, that is pretty cool, actually. That is where my grandfather. I don't know if he's from there, but that's where he lived his entire life. And he took me on my first airplane ride, so it's kind of cool. Owatonna, Minnesota. You guys say that little portable air pump is pretty sweet. Jason has all the cool tools. What's a baler without some twine holding it together? Right? <laughs> Yeah, you, you don't have to have twine holding your hitch together, but it helps. It does help. It does help. All right, moment of truth. Let's see if it drives. Oh. Uh, temperature gauge work? Can't remember. Push that stick forward a little more. There you go. Whew. Holy crap. It actually is pretty sweet to drive. Wow, it actually drove pretty good oh yeah it's, it's pretty good i was holy cow i actually am like pretty much right on there huh sweet <laughs> that's something that you don't get to say that many times i just bought my first swather <laughs> How long you been farming, Jim? Ooh, that's cool. We'll see if it's long enough. Ooh. Try this first. Oh, oh. You got a tire, another one. I'll be damned. All right. Get the air compressor. Did it? Yeah. Oh, I oh, lost it. Dang. We'd probably get the air compressor out there first. Let's okay. Have that.
We'll go slow. <laughs> Here we go. Gotta say, it's, it looks a little sketchy. That's pretty crazy, sketchy looking, isn't it? Pulling a swath through like this. No, I don't see anything out of the normal. <laughs> I mean, nothing. Back to the farm. Hopefully we have a swath through when we get there. How's she pulling? It bounces like the baler. Oh, man. Yeah, if that hitch pops off. Oh, it is bouncing, isn't it? Is it light on the hitch? Is it? It's gotta be. Here. Get back to the your farm. We'll, we'll be, be good. We'll be good. Yeah. It's got a good old 10 miles to go at two miles an hour. Oh, we broke six. We broke six. Yep. This is a steep hill. You just imagine it. Uh, Taking off and going through that barn. <laughs> we see the swather just pass us. You like it's his? <laughs> <laughs> well, whose swather's that? You guys care if we get that swath of feet? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'm never going to use that trailer again. I'd cut it up, haul it straight to the scrap. <laughs> use it for scrap. Yep. You could weld an I-beam to the bottom of it. Use it as a field dragger. Just take your hubs off it. Actually, not a bad idea. Didn't realize I bought a grader the same time I bought a swath in a bailing. One more hill to where if it falls off the hitch, houses are at risk. Yes. <laughs> Ooh. It is perfectly balanced. It would be nice if it was a little more forward, huh? Yeah. Well, we wouldn't have had to dig to China to load it. Plenty of rock, isn't it? Yeah. It's got some rock in this dirt, doesn't it? I really don't like the bouncing. I don't either. You can hear it just wanting to pop off. Wow. The All the houses you do not want to go through, Swather. That is don't, not it. Do not go through that house. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, it's off. Oh, fuck. <laughs> well, well, I guess I'll uh, pull over here. Oh, damn. I wonder if they're home. Yeah, that was it. Well, uh... Oh, uh, hey. Hey. <laughs> Where'd the pin go? How is that even possible? Yeah. We took a street sign out. Oh. You wanna just pull? You yeah, think? I'll try to get it out on Okay, sounds good. All right, well that was scary. <laughs> you know, I believe that. Looks like we didn't really do any damage. Those divots will come out. We did hit a street sign though. Which I think. Was there a pin in it? Yeah. <laughs> it didn't go through the house. It just parked itself on the lawn. All right, so how's that? I bet it just went like that. What the, what the hell kind of freaking pin is that? bullshit is that? Yeah. That don't do anything. I don't think so, Tim. Yeah, but what if that zip tie breaks? Yeah, it's not going to. <laughs> Ah, no, we're not. All right, I'll back up. You back up, I'll... Okay. That's fat. Do something to... More, yeah, more zip ties. Zip ties? Yeah. 
cannot believe that happened. Do you think we need to say anything to these guys? It didn't. I don't think it hurt anything. It didn't hurt anything. You ever lose a swather before? <laughs> Matter of fact, I have. Check that off the bucket list. Yep. So what we're here so lucky that didn't. I mean, we just went down some really steep hills. For a sec, I was like, no, you gotta back up. Like, stop, let it hit the truck. <laughs> Glad you didn't. Buy a junk old baler and swather and freaking buy a pickup truck and a house. <laughs> Sometimes going cheap costs you a lot more. <laughs> I kinda like the green. It is. It's classic. What could you name that thing? You guys know of a name for our swather. <laughs> well, yeah, the pickle. Let us know in the comments. <laughs> Jason's a sorcerer. Whatever you do, Baylor, do not hit that house. Holy well, shit, Baylor, <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Let's try this. All right, Swather, whatever you do, don't make it all the way to Jonas's. There we go. Yeah, you're like a reverse sorcerer. <laughs> Swather's still back there. And we're... We made it back to the farm. We can consider this a win. Yeah. <laughs> we won this one. Zip ties held strong. Zip ties held. Got to surprise Sylvia with the new toy that we got. We want this thing front and center. Welcome home. She knows about it, but she doesn't know how good it looks. All right, now we got to get this thing off here. Nope. What if I jump on this? There she goes. Yeah. Oh. I see why he wants a board. Where's her? Oh, you're right. That's why they dug the hole. I think we found out why the hole's dug. Yeah. Well, what do we do now? So, start it up, drive it forward, and I'll grab some boards, and we'll sit under the what? center tires. Okay. Sounds good. <laughs> we'll get this. up real slow until those boards this side will fall first It's in a safe temperature, but it's definitely warm. That doesn't work, probably. Well, it doesn't. Pillow block bearings are wood. Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. That's, that shows you how old this thing is. And it's still, the belts ran, it freaking cut. I mean, I haven't cut hay with it yet, but. Just try it on your lawn. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna be cut. Yeah, you know the wide deck I built? That's my 86 inch wide deck. Let me show you how she runs. Now I got a wide deck. <laughs> I'm gonna put some air in the tires. All right, we're gonna get to work and uh, I'll bring you guys along for, if I have to do anything to it, but this is my new Swather and the baler. I'm full on Farmer Jonas. Kind of excited, kind of really not excited. I wonder what Sylvia's gonna think. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be pretty cool her up here cutting hay. I know you guys are gonna wanna see that. She's probably gonna want a seat cushion. Yeah, we'll have to upgrade the seat cushion. And a cup holder for her. 
We don't have a tractor, but oh wait, does this drive itself? Yeah. It's got a little moss here and there. It's okay. Here we go. It starts up pretty good. Doesn't sound like it. When I kind of went, it just started kind of spinning. Ooh. All right, now we'll move this in, but pretty cool, huh? Farmer Jonas. Ooh. 